Hello and welcome back to GunPetEat.com, where we help you determine which foods your pet can and cannot eat. In this video, we are going to answer the question, can dogs eat chestnuts? In this video, we will explain exactly what chestnuts are, why dogs can or cannot eat them, and more. We'll also share with you a few foods that are similar that they should absolutely stay away from. So, be sure to watch this entire video to learn if your dog can eat chestnuts. Be sure to like subscribe, and pour the bell icon to be notified when we upload a new video. Also, click the first link in the description for a free guide to train your dog. Question of the day, what has your dog gotten into that scared the daylights out of you? Comment below and your comment may be pinned and featured in a future video. In legends, chestnuts are often believed as a symbol of wealth and prosperity. The Romans, for example, thought that chestnuts would bring them good luck in their business ventures. The Greeks also believed that he would be blessed with good fortune if a man gave his beloved a handful of roasted chestnuts before going to war or embarking on a sea voyage. However, we see chestnuts differently now it's a food we include in our diet that can be part of our snacks. So, the questions are, can we bring good luck to our dogs when we feed chestnuts? Can we bless our dog's health by providing this food? Tough questions were raised, and it's time to make a motion. This article will help you understand chestnuts, their benefits and hazards, and ways to prepare this food safely for feeding your dogs. What are chestnuts? Chestnuts are a kind of fruit that grows during autumn. It grows on a tree called Castania sativa and is commonly found in the northern hemisphere of planet Earth. It's primarily used as a food during the wintertime due to its high calorie content, making it a good source of energy for those out there doing something productive such as hiking or any outdoor activities that require physical activity. Chestnuts can come in both sweet and bitter flavors depending on how much sugar has been produced by their leaves during development. This is why there are two kinds of chestnuts sweet chestnuts and bitter ones. We see chestnuts being mixed with other things such as rice, pasta, and vegetables. It is also used in cooking dishes like soups and stuff that require a meat substitute because of its soft texture, making it easier to break down the digestive system once consumed. Food family of chestnuts. The beech family is the food group that chestnuts belong to. This family food is commonly known for its nutty flavor and crunchy texture. It's also used to make flour which can be seen in most baked goods like pies, cakes, cookies, and pastries. Aside from chestnuts, the beech family comprises famous foods such as acorns, beech nuts, and hazelnuts. These plant seeds need an external temperature of around 15 degrees Celsius to germinate, or else they will not come out from the soil after planting. They are also found in most parts of Asia and Europe. The only way to propagate chestnuts is through seeds. They cannot be grown using root cuttings or grafting techniques like other nuts such as walnuts, hazelnuts, and acorns, making the propagation process relatively slow for this kind of seed. More importantly, chestnuts and other foods under this family provide nutritional value to maintain a healthy body and mind. But can our dogs benefit from this fruit, too? Can dogs eat chestnuts? A big yes. Chestnuts are safe to eat by dogs. This food is easy to eat, prepare, and most significantly, it's not expensive. Chestnuts are rich in vitamins, minerals, and dietary fiber beneficial for our dog's overall health. It provides a good source of healthy carbohydrates that can help give energy to dogs when they're working or playing around the house, too. In addition, it also contains iron which aids in blood production and prevents anemia from happening. However, it's not recommended to feed chestnuts all the time due to high sugar content causing obesity if consumed too much. Plus, it allows stomach upset and diarrhea to dogs if their digestive system is not yet ready for it. With that being in place, we crafted the best ways to feed your dogs with chestnuts. Best ways to feed your dogs with chestnuts. Use chestnuts in stuffing. Chestnuts can be used as an excellent complementary food when you stuff other ingredients such as chicken, beef, or even carrots for your dogs to eat during their mealtime. However, it's not advisable to let them have the whole thing because too much of this fruit causes obesity. Make sure to remove the chestnuts first before feeding your dog with this stuffing. Give them roasted or boiled chestnuts. Chestnuts are also safe for dogs when they're already cooked and ready to be served as a snack during mealtime. It can either be boiled, baked, grilled, 
or even microwaved, only if the skin is removed first, to release its natural oil, making it toxic to dogs. Include nuts as a healthy treat or snack. Chestnuts can be given as a special treat for your dog during their playtime around the house, too. You may also include other nuts, such as walnuts and peanuts, in moderation so that you won't risk obesity in your dog if they overeat these healthy treats. Reasons why dogs can eat chestnuts. As dog owners, we are concerned about the health benefits your dog gets after eating chestnuts. So, we list down practical reasons why chestnuts are best for your dog's diet. Chestnuts contain complex carbohydrates and high protein. Chestnuts have complex carbohydrates that support the growth of healthy bacteria in our dog's digestive system. It also prevents gastrointestinal issues, such as diarrhea and constipation, when consumed regularly too. Additionally, this food also has a good amount of protein beneficial to the body. Therefore, this food makes them strong even without eating meat. It has fiber. Chestnuts contain soluble and insoluble fibers in promoting the health of your dog's heart. In addition, it helps in increasing bulk in the stool, lowers cholesterol levels, and manages weight by preventing blood sugar spikes. Also, chestnuts improve the digestive system to avoid constipation or diarrhea because it absorbs water during digestion. It prevents cardiovascular disease. Chestnuts have a good amount of fiber beneficial for dogs to prevent cardiovascular diseases from occurring due to the high fat content in their diet. In this way, dogs can have good heart health when consumed regularly. It provides iron to dogs. Chestnuts contain essential minerals such as phosphorus, sodium, potassium, and magnesium, which help maintain the healthy cardiovascular function of your dog's body. It also has vitamin C that boosts immunity against common illnesses, while the presence of copper is beneficial for metabolism support. Possible concerns when eating chestnuts. Too much of everything could result in something hazardous. In other words, you have to feed enough chestnuts to your dogs. Otherwise, they may suffer from the following possible health concerns. Chestnuts are not suitable for dogs with diabetes. If your dog has insulin resistance or even hypoglycemia, it is best to avoid feeding chestnuts because this fruit could worsen your dog's condition. If you're wondering why chestnuts have high amounts of sugar, they are bad for diabetic dogs. It also affects blood glucose levels if consumed regularly. Chestnuts are rotten for dogs with allergies. If your dog has food allergies, you need to watch out when feeding chestnuts because this fruit is related to birch and pine pollen most allergy-prone pets suffer from. If your dog can't eat chestnuts due to an allergic reaction, the best thing to avoid is this fruit in their diet. It has goitrogens. Goitrogenic foods interfere with healthy thyroid function by blocking the uptake of iodine, leading to abnormal enlargement of the gland, goiter. This can happen if your dog eats chestnuts regularly or in large amounts. It may also cause weight gain, hair loss, and lethargy. Chestnuts can trigger pancreatitis. Suppose your dog has a history of pancreatitis or even obesity issues. In that case, you need to avoid feeding chestnuts because they are high in fat which we already mentioned earlier that it's bad for dogs with cardiovascular problems and diabetes. However, if consumed occasionally as treats only, there are no concerns about feeding chestnuts to your dogs. Signs your dog is sick from eating chestnuts. Unusual actions from your dog form part and gradually contribute to a more significant health problem. Dogs behave differently when they're sick. So, you better watch out for the list below. Inability to move. If your dog is lethargic and has difficulties moving, you need to monitor him because it may be a sign of pain. In this case, chestnut poisoning can result from overeating which we already discussed the potential health concerns when consuming chestnuts regularly. Not feeling well. Dry and flaky skin combined with itchy redness in the body can be a sign of allergies. In addition, chestnuts contain goitrogenic chemicals that may trigger allergic reactions. Other signs include vomiting or diarrhea when fed chestnuts raw or even after cooking them. Hiding. Your dog may always stay in one place and not come out. It may be a sign that chestnuts are causing your dog discomforts, such as pain and lethargy due to difficulty breathing or heart problems and allergies. What to do if your dog is sick from eating chestnuts? Don't get panicked and alarmed, your dog needs your immediate attention. However, you have first to identify the symptoms that your dog is experiencing. This will help you better understand what's going on with your dog. 
When chestnuts are consumed, it generally takes about 12 hours before these fruits cause any health risks or allergies in dogs. But if other things are involved, such as an allergic reaction brought by pollen from trees where chestnuts are grown, the signs and symptoms will appear in just a few hours. Call your vet to know what's causing your dog sickness chestnut poisoning or other allergies from pollen contained inside this fruit. Dogs should not consume chestnuts. So, it's better to keep them away from eating it. Finally, take note of all these health concerns so you will be able to recognize the signs and symptoms. Avoid similar foods from this family. Hazelnuts. Hazelnuts are a potential threat to your dog's health since they are related to poison ivy, sumac, and ragweed. This food contains saponins which is a toxic compound that causes severe vomiting and diarrhea. Pecans. Even though pecans are not as harmful to your dog, they still contain the same compounds mentioned earlier saponin, which can trigger allergies in dogs because it has an irritant effect on their intestinal tract or stomach lining. It also contains tannic acid, a type of tannin found in the bark, leaves, and fruit husks. Walnuts. The same with pecans, walnuts are not harmful to dogs, but they may cause digestive problems because they contain purgative oils that act as laxatives on your dog resulting in vomiting and diarrhea. Pine nuts. Suppose your dog has terrible allergies because of pine nuts which can cause hives or other skin problems. In that case, it's better to avoid feeding chestnuts since it contains similar chemicals that may trigger allergic reactions in dogs. How to make chestnuts safe to eat. We're grateful that you made it from here. It's a sign that you want to take care of your dog's health from beyond. We may not award you like the best dog owner, but we ensure that you'll have something valuable before you leave. Hence, here are methods on how to make chestnuts safe for feeding. Avoid overfeeding. Don't give your dog more than what he can eat in one day because excess food intake will only cause digestive problems and other health risks, such as pain, lethargy due to difficulty breathing because of heart problems, and allergies. Use the proper cooking method. If you're planning to feed your dog with chestnuts, make sure that it's safe for consumption by dogs first before doing so. It is advisable to cook this fruit because some of its substances are removed when cooked or baked which may help lessen allergic reactions in dogs compared to when they eat this fruit raw. Consult this food to your vet. In this day and age, when many dog owners may not know what's best for their dogs, you must ask the advice from your vet to help provide accurate information about whether or not chestnuts can be fed to dogs. You may ask for a consultation or a diet plan to follow to ensure your dog's safety and proper nutrition. Hopefully, we've helped you decide if the food was safe to eat. If we did, be sure to check out a free guide to turn your good doggy into a great doggo. Also, comment below if you'd like us to help you determine if your pet can eat other types of foods. Disclaimer, Can Pet Eat does not intend to provide veterinary advice. We go to great lengths to help users better understand their dogs. However, the information provided is not a substitute for veterinary guidance. Please be advised we are not veterinarians. Always consult your veterinarian.